All right, here's where we are with the garden so far. I have, basically it's halfway done. I've got those two eight foot lengths staked into the ground with half inch rebar. And the end of it staked in there. I've got most of the dirt shoveled in there. In fact, I might have to shovel some out. I might have too much in there. And I dug a, I don't know if you can see it in this light, but I kind of dug a trench along the ground level so I can put the next section in. Now the way I'm doing this is I'm stacking three of these landscaping ties, landscaping timbers, whatever you want to call them, stacking them up three on top of each or on top of each other there and you just make sure that they're pretty much flush here on this end and same thing on the other end make sure they're flush pretty much now they are sometimes irregular so you might get slightly different lengths so you just center them as best as you can like I've had a few that stick out like uh, maybe a centimeter or a half a centimeter out further so they're, it's not perfect but that's why we do this you just get them centered as best as possible and then you get them lined up uh, uh, vertically I'm sorry vertically and I like to just take my drill and hold it like pretty much close to the edge right about there and then I'll just drill right about where the tip of the drill bit is and the reason why I don't measure from the end um, say like 16 inches and then just drill in the center is because sometimes these are warped so if you just measure 16 inches and you drill straight through the middle on all of them the hole might not line up just because of the irregularities and warped uh, and it doesn't even have to be bad, but you want it to be perfectly lined up, so that's why I do it this way. Now I'll start drilling the hole, and I'll go through the first one and into the second one. And then I'll do the other hole down at the other end, same thing, through the first top one into the second one. Then I'll pull the top one off, and then I'll drill from the second one down into the one in the bottom. That way you know which ones are top, middle, and bottom, and they'll all be lined up perfectly. 